Hey, hello, hello. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Tech Granta. So, on the today video lecture, we are going to discuss about the true client protocol, like how we can record the script using the true true, true client protocol. So, if anyone missed the last video lecture, please just go and watch it on the playlist is already uh, created, and you can learn the Jenkins tool also, which video is still going on. So. Uh, Please uh, subscribe the channel and if anyone missed the video, please go and watch it. And if you have any confusion, any doubt regarding the session, just comment me in the comment box. I will try to reply you as soon as possible. Okay. So let's we start about the true client protocol. How can we do the recording and replay? How can we do the parameters and everything? So what you need to do, first of all, you need to open the view gen. After that, just click on the file option and then go on the new script and solution. So because this is the another true uh, protocol so here you are getting that true client web so just select on that protocol and the same things just give here uh, i am going to show you the blaze demo uh, true client one application and i just selected the true client web protocol and then just create it okay so after creating what you need to do uh, there you can also if you go on the chromium so here it is mentioned you want to true client browser i whatever so by default, I am just going to record. So how can I record that script? So just click on the develop script. So once you will click on the develop script, uh, your true client uh, protocol things will open. Okay, so now we are going to record. So what you need to do, that is the one option here is the start. So there you need to do the start option, click and here you need to perform whatever the business flow you are going to do. So I just click the start button there. So here you can see recording is uh, started. So here I just given as uh, blaze demo dot com. Okay, I just enter that. So here also you can see those uh, step is also going on. So again I select at the Boston and the destination I took as a London. Then I just click on the find flight okay and then i click on the choose this flight so now those all in from uh, operation we perform and there you can see the option has been recording there also now our recording has been done so just click on that stop option okay now i stop that one just click on the save and now you can see how uh, your script has been also changed on your true client so if you go on the true client script So there also you can see there is the four different type of the uh, steps has been also uh, created on your view gen. So there also you can save that script. Okay. So this is the uh, basic things how you can record the script. Now, if you go on uh, the true client protocol again, so there also you can see it. Uh, okay. So there you can see your application has been recorded. there. So what I'm just going to do first, I'm just going to uh, replay it directly. Then I will show you how can you put the checkpoint, how you can you put there, uh, start and end transaction, everything. So first I'm just doing the replay. Uh, there you also can see the replacement succeed. Okay, now what the next option we need to do, we are going to see uh, now how can we put the oh, transactions name so there is is the one watch type of the things they just click on that transaction and here this is the addition you just click on that here you give the transaction so i just given as zero one open app okay click on the apply button there so there it will ask like which how many step is uh, considered under the open app so i know only the navigation it is a starting transition like you can see here the first number is your flash demo then it is end on also on the same so here you can see your start open app is comes under only that part okay now just go on the second transition so second transition was the zero to find So our find flight, uh, it is started from there 
and it is end on the click on the find flight button okay now again go on the third transaction so third transaction is 03 underscore choose flights okay so it is a start on the choose flight button and that is a stop also on the same so now if now here you can see the all transaction i mentioned uh, which transition is coming on which channel. okay so now if again i'm going to uh, replay that script so there also you can see iteration one to one action is performing so it is going but on here you can see it will be reflect also on the same level now your uh, blessed demo application page has been there now it is finding from boston to london and after that it will click on the find flight button okay yeah so now it is the choose the button also happened so the replay has been succeed successfully now the next thing okay now what i need to do i want to do here this is a boston and london this is the origin and destination i want to parameterize that one so how i can do so just go on uh, just click on that and replace that with that command okay tc dot get param and this is your parameter name so this is the origin and here you need to select as a chairs okay so the same thing just go on for london and do there and just mention here the destination okay and just select here as the chairs so here also I just click on the JS and just again I click on this. Now after that, what you need to do? Okay. So what are the parameter name you given there? So there I just given as the origin. I'm just pasting the value also origin and destination. Okay. So I'm just creating the uh, your that file there. Okay. So on the dat file I just given as origin and destination. Okay, so now okay, so origin I just selected by origin. So there I'm just pointing origin and destination both that file. This is our destination, refer as the origin. Now I just change that script with the parameterization there. Okay, now I'm going to execute that script. So what you need to do, just go on your application and just execute it once again okay so now it is going on i already did the parameterization or the and destination so it will go and I will see how it is behaving and how it is going to execute there. Okay, so now there I'm just going to replay that script again and I just click on Okay, so that replay also has been succeeded. Okay, so those are things uh, just we want to discuss today. Okay, thanks to all.